What's up everybody? This is your boy Mark from Mark's Kitchen here with another episode. Dear Mark, I really don't like shrimp and bacon's a little strange, dude. I've done this recipe with chicken, pork, some steak. You can try whatever you want. Fried rice is so easy to make. You just take some old rice, put a bunch of vegetables and meat, mix it with a little soy sauce, and you got yourself some real knob fried rice. To get you started, you're gonna want a knob of ginger. The easiest way to peel the skin off is with the back of a spoon. Chop it into little pieces, and you got it, dude. The easiest way to chop garlic, cut off the end, pound it with the back of a knife and the skin comes off like butter dude and chop that similarly to the ginger along with some bacon and green onions and you got yourself your aromatics get some shrimpies season them with salt and pepper and some dark soy sauce for color when you're cooking with meat put the meat in the pan first that's going to create extra flavor for your dish put your shrimp and bacon in until they're done cooking and then put them to the side get some more oil in there cook your egg until it is scrambled and done more oil ginger and garlic in until it's fragrant put your veggies in toss the wok so everything is combined I use day-old rice that I put in the refrigerator overnight this will ensure all the grains are separated when you're making your fried rice push out the clumps and you're rocking and rolling dude and add your spices MSG cayenne ground white pepper and some salt get yourself some soy sauce put it around the wok this will heat it up and get Give it some extra flavor. Put in your eggs, your meat, and give it a couple nice tosses. Finish this bad boy off with some sesame oil. Toss it a couple more times for good measure. Put it in a bowl with some sesame seeds and finish with some green onions. And you got yourself some fried rice, dude. I mean, look at this bowl of fried rice. I don't know what to do, but to uh, dive right in, dude. First bite. This fried rice recipe is so tasty, flavor packed, and it's real not right there, all right? Thank you all for tuning in to another episode of Mark's Kitchen. And you all right know what they say. If you can do it in Mark's Kitchen, you can do it in your kitchen. Peace.